so we're back back on my ps all right guys so what is up uh yeah we're back on last claudia i was gonna make a call of duty video and just rent the whole time and just talk to you guys but i i didn't want to do that today and i was like let's make an lc video so <laughs> we're here and um so yeah so we're gonna be talking about these souls now how you can you get these unit souls you can also get these unit souls from these gusher pulls right here you can get them by using friend points or get that uh free ten, uh, times 10 gasha pool that's right there yeah you can do every eight hours um but yeah you can also acquire them by doing the story if you go to the world map and you know that's where you go to the story you can do it right there you can also go to these events right here and these conquer list and you can get these souls that's right here on the side connecting uh, uh, connecting okay there we go uh, can, oh there we go now um at first when i first did this i put it on five hours because i didn't know what it really was but i will recommend 20 hours you know why you want to do 20 hours because you can get the most souls from them so that's what that's what i suggest that's what i think you should do that's my opinion and you get the most souls from 20 so yes um uh, now on to the next now we go back down here to the units and we go click on one unit you can also use the unit souls on awakening you can awaken your unit i don't have it unlocked yet but you know your boy will you can also use it on skill cost now the skill cost is uh where you gonna buy here excuse me it's so it's basically your skill cost right here uh your abilities everything you want to unlock right here so this is what you want to do you want to build this baby up all this you want to have all this unlocked all this this is right here this is nothing you don't want to have this this is trash okay you want to be able to go to everything and unlock it like i just did right there and progress down and keep on progressing down the more that you progress down the more that you can unlock the more abilities you can get and that's for passives too the more passive abilities you can get uh, as you see right here, I have the two skills, Spin and Strike, Trick Spear. Then if I go to a different unit like Bullet Rose, I go to the abilities. I have Sonic Sting, Bloody Shower, and I have my special. So yeah, you can just unlock a whole bunch of different things like that if you want to. Now you go back, I will recommend to use it on your skill cost so you can just put it down a little bit. Your skill cost can be down, so that's, that's one of the most important things. You want the most abilities, you want the most passives, you want the most uh, magic that you can use for this character or for any character uh so i highly recommend for you using your skill cost limit you use that baby right there connect thing skill cost 24 easy you know what i'm saying now i have a total of 18 i'm gonna be using those and uh yeah so that's gonna be it for this video i hope you enjoyed it please like sub and subscribe and if you want more tips and more videos on last claudia hit that like button and subscribe and uh, I'll see you guys later, and I don't know why I went to that. I'll see you guys later, and uh, I'm out. Peace.